A question I get a lot, and you may have thought about, is what happens if we actually find a signal? I mean, it could happen tonight. It might even happen this afternoon. I mean, you know, do we pick up the red telephone and call the White House? Do we notify the UN? Do we notify anybody? Well, the answer is if you pick up a signal that looks surreal, you don't announce it right away because it might not be for real. <laughs> you know, it could just be an Earth satellite going by or just a bug in your software, something, okay? So the first thing you do is actually pick up the phone and talk to somebody at another observatory and get them to verify the signal. That's just science. If you can't replicate the experiment, there's something wrong, okay? <laughs> now, are there protocols? Are there sort of official policies? Well, there is a protocol, one that was first developed during the 1980s, during the Cold War, because there was some concern that maybe the Soviets would find the aliens first, or maybe the Americans would, and you know, would they get along and tell one another and stuff like that. Okay, now that particular protocol has been revised by the International Academy of Astronautics. You can find it on the SETI Institute's website, actually. But what does it say? You can read it, it's not very long, but it says only really three things. If you find a signal, verify it, of course. If after you verify it, you just tell everybody, of course. I say, of course, you may not believe me, but that is true. And the third thing, and this is in some ways the most interesting part of the protocol, is that it says, don't send a reply. Don't answer the signal. Don't, don't talk into space without some sort of international consultation and agreement that it's okay to do that, or this is what they want to say, or you want to say, that kind of thing. All right. Those are the protocols, but I can tell you on the basis of false alarms we've had, what really happens is a little different. What really happens is if you pick up a signal, of course there's no policy of secrecy, and immediately the media start calling you up, the local TV station, the radio, newspapers, magazines, everybody, your phone begins to get warm from the ringing. That's what really happens. So in fact, what will happen is it'll be a very messy thing. If we actually pick up a signal, you know, you're going to read about it in all sorts of publications, which are in many ways not so reliable, but the story will be out there. It'll be big news and it'll be everywhere.